I really don't know. And I've never played here before, so mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't know if uh, people keep telling me that people are excited for it, but I don't know if people will even be watching me when I play. You know what I mean? Because I'm new here. It's 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 life really, and and it's no for me. It's got to be music because without music, you know, as soon as I wake up in the morning, I I, I hate silence. Do you know what I mean? And I've got to put music on. Got to put records on, and even when I'm having a shower, I'm on my own in the flat. You know, I need to have music on uh, uh, all the time. Even in the dressing room before the gig, I've got to have tunes banging. And for me, it's everything. You know, playing my guitar and singing and expressing myself. And I'd go insane if if I couldn't get my feelings out. You know what I mean? It's something that I, it's like a drug for me. I just Whatever. dissolve into the floor. <laughs> I'm excited to watch the Queens of Stone Age today, actually, you know, I'm a fan of them, or a band like Kasabian, you know, bands that, that I like bands that make me feel up, you know, and they, and they make you feel, and when you're watching them, you're like, it makes me want to play, play, you know what I mean? That's what I like. I like, I like good rock and roll bands, you know. I don't like any of this airy, fairy shit, you know. I like it to be fucking good and solid and big and... I'm still looking for it, yeah. <laughs> I know, but there's plenty of places to seek it. But you know, yeah, I'm just having fun, and I'm quite enjoying seeking for it. Don't know. I think there's something may- maybe you know. Yeah, I, I like the idea of it. Yeah. Sometimes I'll say a prayer. Like, I hope, hope the gig goes well tonight. So <laughs> okay. if he is up there, make the gig a good one, man. You know. It is what it is, that man, yeah. I'm a rock I'm a rock and roll star and that's all I wanna be, you know. Be Paul Weller or John Lennon, because I love the, the songs they've written and the way they express themselves and their attitudes, you know. Uh, and yeah, I just like staying true. There's Deep Valley over there. Big balls, man. And then, um, yeah, I just, anyone that's, that's real and true to themselves, really. Do you know what I mean? And I, I love Mark Bolan as well, you know. And they seem like sort of like gods or something in a way. Do you know what I mean? Like like where no one really knows anything about them. And I think in this day and age with like Twitter and... I mean, I do Twitter and stuff, but some people that do Twitter all the time, there's no secret or there's no mystery with any artists. And I think as a fan, I, I like to guess what my hero would be doing, do you know what I mean? Because it makes it it makes it more special where nowadays I just think everyone knows what everyone's having for fucking lunch, do you know what I mean? And and I don't really like that. I think it's good to keep that mystery and, and keep people guessing because if you give it all away then I, they'll just get bored here and I don't you know I don't think that Yeah I just think it's like if you want longevity I think mystery is good. It's not like I want to live in fucking 1964. I'm happy here because I'm doing what I do. But I just think you can. It's easy to get caught up in all that media bullshit. Do you know what I mean? And like, I just don't want to do that. You know? Probably, yeah. But you know, I don't know. I, just, I know what I like, and I just want to play my music and have a good time and go out there and fucking have it. You know. Bloody racket! <laughs> what a bloody racket! <laughs>